Cheryl and Rob, a relative of the 52 year old man who was shot, says he is a well known community leader. They say he was with his four year old grandson when shots were fired. They also say that he did all he could to keep that child from getting hurt. A grandfather and two teenagers are among three people hospitalized after a Wednesday afternoon shooting on Chicago's near West Side. We're getting a person shot 115 North Oakley in the alley. Also getting a call for shots fired. Shots came from a silver Altima. Multiple evidence markers, some next to shell casings, were left behind near an alley along North Oakley near Maple. Chicago police say a 16-year-old, a 17-year-old, and a 52-year-old were shot and wounded. A relative of the 52-year-old who wanted to remain anonymous tells us the grandfather was in the area with his four-year-old grandson. It was a, a drive-by shooting. My relative, he was standing outside with his grandson and the individual or individuals um, you know, pulled up, started shooting. As those shots were being fired, the 52-year-old jumped into action to shield his grandson. He protected his grandson. He grabbed his grandson and shielded him so he won't get hurt and he ended up getting shot. The 52-year-old was shot in the shoulder area. Thanks to the man's quick thinking, police say the 4-year-old suffered cuts and scrapes but was not shot. The grandfather and the two teens who were shot were taken to Stroger Hospital in good condition. Meanwhile, police say the suspects drove away and crashed this vehicle nearby before running away. Neighbors reacting tonight. It's just sad, you know, uh, but everybody just needs to watch their children, you know, keep them safe, keep them close. Last we heard from investigators, no one is in custody and this case is still under investigation. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.